Hello everyone, welcome to or welcome back to my channel. I have just a couple of things to share with you guys. I had found these really cool earrings, which Winnie showed on her channel recently. And I wanted to share it with you guys too, because I'm the one who shared these with Winnie and we both bought them. They came in this nice little dust bag. And here we have these earrings hopefully you could see let me hold them like this can you see they look like they look like you know what uh -huh. it's a nail something that looks like a nail and they're little huggy hoops it's silver tone of course rhinestones and guys these were 10 bucks so I'm going to link these if you're interested and if you want to take a look, that would be fantastic. If you want to get a pair for yourself for 10 bucks, you can't go wrong. I think the next thing I want to share with you, I thought it was leggings when I picked up the package because I did order leggings, but you know, Yota has been going on and on and on, you know, she's just in love with Lululemon and I don't know she lounges in this stuff guys but this is really supposed to be for like exercising and going to yoga and running and whatnot and for the little bit of exercise that I can actually do I'm good just going as I am and you know as far as leggings go have been very happy with my $20 Target leggings which I'm going to show you one day because they're phenomenal and oh, they're just so soft and they have pockets. Go figure. So the leggings didn't come, but I did order a t-shirt and I'm gonna share the t-shirt with you. You know, maybe it'll help if you've ever been curious about Lululemon. Um, I found these things on sale. I will show the leggings when I get them, but I couldn't really figure out what size to buy because, you know, I did the size predictor on the leggings and it told me that I should order a size six. And guys, I haven't been a size six since like 1997, okay? It's been a while. So I just kind of guesstimated and figured whatever a large would be and I ordered them. So we'll see when they come if I guess the size right and what the fit is, et cetera, et cetera. But I told Yota, I said, I better turn into a fairy princess after you ranting about these things. And, you know, I don't know what it's magically going to do for me because, you know, I mean, lounge wear is lounge wear. Like comfy is, is comfy. This is a very comfy top. I wear it in, I wear it out. It's soft. And I don't feel like a magical unicorn. I just feel comfy. So here is the top that I ordered. And most of their things don't come small, medium, and large. They come in numbered sizes, which I thought was really odd. Like leggings are stretchy. Why do you need a number size? The same with their t-shirts. Now, usually if you order a number size shirt, it's typically a button-down shirt or something that's fitted, not for a t-shirt. T-shirts come small, medium, large, extra large. This t-shirt, again, I had to try to guesstimate my size. So I said, okay, I'll order a 14. This is enormous. I mean, it's enormous. Look at this. I mean, this wraps completely, completely around past my sides so i know that this is going to be loose i wanted it loose and comfy it did say that it was oversized but i really didn't expect that it was going to be quite this large but it's okay the fabric feels nice it doesn't really feel anything all that impressive to me it's really sheer i mean i guess if you're exercising you want something that's light and sheer I don't really get what these lines across the back are supposed to do. Uh, it looks like it's slightly high-low hem. Like this. You know, 
I think I paid maybe $40 for this. It must have been around $40. And that was on sale. Honestly, if I saw this hanging up somewhere, um, I sure wouldn't pay the full price. That's for sure. Oh, yeah. Full price was $58. This does not feel in any way, shape, or form like a $58 t-shirt. I'm going to say that right now. I don't know if these last so long. I, I really just kind of don't get it. I mean, the seams and everything are finished really well. I don't see any loose threads anywhere. It looks like the binding on the top is really well done. Here's the size tag. Why you need all this is just totally beyond me. Um, but yeah, I mean... This is the gray. It came in white and it came in gray. And I mean, it's okay. It's going to be comfortable, but certainly not by any stretch of the imagination does this seem like it's anything that would be a $60 t-shirt. Not by a long shot. I love Life is Good. They're really extremely extremely well made. The fabric is beautiful and they are a million times nicer than this Lululemon shirt. So we'll wait and see what happens when the leggings come in, but I'm not really impressed at all. Sorry, Yota, but truth's the truth. So the other thing that I got, and again, guys, I'm trying to be practical, is in this shoe box. And if you've been watching my channel for any length of time, you know, Mephisto is my all-time favorite shoe brand. I have seriously problematic feet. I have rheumatoid arthritis, and I have really awful problems with my ankles. And my ankle doesn't really bend all the way, and I need to have supportive shoes all the time. So even walking in the house, especially if I'm doing any kind of housework, I can't be in you know, socks or barefoot because it's very, very painful for me. So I just happened to be searching around looking for slippers. I had pretty good luck with Ugg slippers. They're decent for house shoes. Um, I like the look of Ugg boots and I will wear my Ugg boots if it's really cold, but they're not great for your feet because they have zero support. The slippers are okay because the shearling kind of molds to your foot after a while, but that's a slipper. So anyway, I found on the Nordstrom website these Mephisto slippers on sale. Here is the box. Uh, see, look, Nature's Future. Inside. You'll see open them up. Ooh. Oh, how cute. Oh, I'm loving these guys. Okay, so this is a boiled wool slipper, and inside it says nature's future. And this is their Mobilis line. And the Mobilis line features very cushioned insoles. And you can see these are extremely, extremely supportive. You can see that arch support, the heel cuff, their shock absorbers. And here's a label that says nature is future. These are boiled wool. And they're just these cute little clogs. The sole you can wear outside. This is a firm sole, but I bought these to wear in the house. But I like if I need to bring the trash out or something, it's great to have a bottom that I don't have to worry, you know, if the ground is wet, that anything's going to seep through my foot and get me wet because I would not be so happy. So I did order my typical size in Mephisto. They only come whole sizes. I ordered a 36. I am going to try these on. Oh, 
and I will let you know how they feel. Okay, my left foot is the worst of the two, and I'm hoping that I'm gonna be able to get my foot inside. It shouldn't be a problem. This is really soft, and the wool should also mold to my foot. So, fingers crossed that this is gonna work. All right, I probably should remove my sock, but uh, yes, <laughs> oh my God, they feel amazing. They feel amazing. So I don't know if this is gonna be, here's what they look like. Yeah. Oh guys, I am so happy. So these were originally $156, which is an insane price to pay for slippers. But they were on sale for, I think, $74.99, which I was happy to pay for because I've also had Vionic slippers. They were good too, but they're also in the same price range. And the Vionic slippers, they didn't hold up as well as I thought they would. And... I mean, my best experience, foot experience, has always been with Mephisto. I know the level of comfort that they have and the level of support. So when I saw that these were available, I figured I would try it. And I know that these are going to last for a long time. So, you know, I'm very, very satisfied with my purchase. And I think the color combination is just adorable. I love this pink with gray. So... Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.